Kansas City program hoping to help people who need medical care and can't afford it, and it starts with the coins in your pocket. The now KC's Ray Daniel has more on how loose change is hoping to make a big change. Over the past several years, being able to see was quite the challenge for Luther Dawson. I probably purchased maybe 15 to 20 pairs of them, only to find out that um, I really needed um, to have my eyes examined. Uninsured, Dawson said he couldn't pay to get an eye exam. I was literally walking around um, not being able to see. That's when he called Medicine Cabinet. Kansas City Medicine Cabinet provides emergency medical assistance to people in the metropolitan area. Short term, short term emergency assistance. Medical assistance for people who are uninsured or underinsured. We go from Excelsior Springs to Belton and we assist from um, Eastern Jackson County to Western Wyandotte and um, Johnson County. And for those who meet the program's guidelines. Income based program. So we start with 200% um, of the federal poverty level. There's another series of things that they would go through and then um, Eventually, um, we would give them a voucher and we would take care of uh, providing them the assistance they needed. Assistance such as diabetic supplies, dental emergencies, medical equipment, prescriptions, and vision care. So nobody should have to um, pick between food or and uh, prescriptions or whether they pay their rent or get their eyeglasses. And we want people to know that there's a program out there that people can get assistance. This week, Medicine Cabinet holds its annual fundraiser called Coins for the Cabinet. Jars and boxes are placed at various local businesses and schools for people to drop their loose change. All the money raised goes to help people with their needs. Program administrators say Medicine Cabinet started back in 2005 and has provided more than 30,000 services to people and roughly $6 million for those services. For the Now KC, I'm Ray Daniel. And for more information about the program and its annual fundraiser of coins for the cabinet, we have that information on our website, kshb.com.